Hopefully they put on some great action in this one. All right, the main event. Light heavyweights, Paul Mintz and Scott Lighty. Both uh, striking specialists. Mintz training out of the underground fight club. He looks, he looks determined. He looks, uh, he looks like he's coming in here first time in the cage. Let's see how that uh, plays out. Scott Lighty also a featured uh, tap out fighter. Will be on, gonna be fighting for the combat. Yeah, they're out out. Ooh, they're coming out <laughs> like they mean it. Ooh, oh, both guys connecting. Yeah, I, like I said, don't blink on this one. Ooh, good right hand from Paul Mintz. Another ooh, the ah, head kick. Man, these guys are going at it. This is the this is the way to end the night. Hmm. Body shot. Lighty coming forward. Caught him with that left hook. If that kick would have landed, that would have been bad. Whoa. Well, you know, this is, this is amazing to watch these guys go out. Ooh. Uh-oh, I think uh, Paul might have got his bell on a little bit there. Ooh, he's, he's starting to eat yeah, some but shots. You know, he does a good job of composing himself going for a shot. You know, he's definitely game. Good sprawl from Light Lighty, though. Good tosses him off to a uh, wizard. Gonna watch those shots in the back of the head there. Yeah, I think that's why he stopped striking. Head pressure. All right, back to the feet. <laughs> Ooh, good nice. right from Minx. Man, these guys are going back and forth. Ooh, there's that Chuck Liddell right hand. Oh, head, head kick. kick. Hot almost. Oh, ooh, a series of. Okay, Paul pushes him back, trying to get back to top position. Mm, ate some good ones you know, I'm surprised that uh, he's able to compose himself as well as he has. A lot of people would have been done there. I mean, some yeah. people could think, you know, the fight could have been stopped. But, you know, honestly, he was doing a good job of composing himself. Right now, he looks to be in a little bit of trouble, but not too much range on those punches. Not, not super, more of a pepper right now. Yeah, yeah. As, as they get more and more, you know, that's when that's when he's going to be in trouble. Yep. Here we accumulation. go. Those are some solid punches that are landing. You know, Lighty, this may be his first time in the cage, but you know with the competition that he trains with, the school that he trains with, he's been, uh, I'm sure he's been training this for years. I'm well, sure. he's already inside me. That was so, half guard. Oh, yeah, half guard. Way to correct me. I owe you 50 cents. <laughs> Making some money back. Uh, nice elbow. Yeah, nice short elbow. Ooh. Larry's looking, looking probably to stop it now. Paul keeps but, time. Yeah, mm -hmm. Mintz actually mm -hmm. just keeps on making a doll and protecting himself. Mm. Mm. He's trying to punch back. Not necessarily the greatest idea when you're on your back. But I've, that alone shows you that he still has fight in yeah, him. Yeah, that's uh, he's got heart. Ooh, those are some good elbows there. Mm. That's some ooze. Oh. Mm, I think Mintz and the bell. All right. That was looking pretty pretty um, rough. Right? I think I think this fight's over. I don't think he's gonna continue. And he's standing up. He looks a little wobbly here. Yeah. Let's have a ringside. Oh, head, head kick. It was the, I think it was this flurry here that really puts him down. If you didn't have cauliflower here seconds. before, you do now. Yeah. Mm, perfect head kick. But look at that, his composure. Yeah, he, he, uh, it was these, the, these punches here, that uh, about three punches that really that really rocked him. That, but he was able to push Lighty off of him immediately. He kept his head. Kept it, he got hit by a lot of solid shots here, but he kept uh, covering up and defending. Even trying to mount a little bit of offense back. I can see him coming into the second round. That was a, a stop. Rough first, uh, yeah, I think uh, I think the doctor may have stopped the fight. This fight is stopped on the advice of the ringside physician. Your winner, by DKO from San Diego. Always feels good to get the W. Yep. Paul took some some abuse there at the end of that last round. 
But a uh, good, good cap to the night of fights. Uh, glad, great, uh, great, great to have you here, Joe. Uh, Thanks for having me. I mean, it's been an awesome night of fights, and um, I can't wait to see the next night. We'll be having our next show, uh, Pure Combat, uh, Bring the Pain, May 9th in Stockton, California. Uh, for the World Middleweight title, for the Pure Combat Middleweight title, we've got uh, Jaime El Kukui Hara against uh, Steve Heath, the King of Stockton. Should be a great bout. And will Bud Light also be sponsoring you? Oh, the yes. King of Beers. The King of Beers, Bud Light, will be our sponsor. Check with El Posen for pictures with his uh, Scott Lighty protege. You know, Chuck's getting up and uh, starting to get up in years. He's still got some fights left in him for sure, but uh, you know, Scott Lighty might be the next Chuck Liddell. He was throwing those Chuck Liddell right hands. Keep same style of fighting. a lot of stuff that looked very painful. <laughs> yeah. Well, I'd like to take this, uh, this Joe Stevenson telling you guys at home, uh, thanks for watching and supporting Pure Combat.